Hi everyone, welcome to our awesome veterinary website demo. I am Furkan Munir, student of DVM and working as a developer on the project Awesome Veterinary under the supervision of highly skilled mentor Saratna Kiran Mova for Cloud Native Computing Foundation. He is a maintainer of Open EBS and Litmus projects and data management nerd. You must visit our site in order to get more information by typing the given URL. In awesome veterinary site, you can get latest information about veterinary medicine, veterinary services, DVM notes for undergraduate students, news, upcoming events, photos, videos, medicines, animal breeds, and vaccination schedule. Let's have a quick visit to our site. Open your browser and type the awesome veterinary URL. This is the home screen of our website. If you wish to better know about us, just visit this section. In gallery section, we will post inf images about animals. In this section, you can get latest news about veterinary profession. In laboratory diagnosis, you can get information about diagnosis like milk analysis, livestock feed analysis, veterinary biology, pathology, histopathology, etc. In library section, you can get information other than laboratory diagnosis like livestock management, theriogenology, veterinary preventive medicine, dairy breeds of animals, pharmaceutical calculations, anatomy, etc. If you wish to better know about immunization in dairy breeds of animals, just visit this section. Here is the complete detail of immunization in dairy breeds of animals. If a question will arise in your mind, please feel free to ask it. Pathology is that branch of medicine that deals with study of causes and effects of diseases. The word pathology also refers to the study of diseases and forensic examination of animals. Histopathology is the diagnosis and study of diseases of the tissues and involves examining tissues or cells under a microscope. Histopathologists are responsible for making tissue diagnoses and helping clinicians manage a patient's care. Radiology is the medical discipline that uses medical imaging to diagnose and treat diseases within the bodies of animals. We get radiographic images with the help of certain machines like X-ray machine, ultrasound machine, etc. Microbiology is the study of microscopic organisms such as bacteria, viruses, archaea, fungi, and protozoa. Bacteriology is the study of bacteria. In veterinary bacteriology, we study those bacteria that cause diseases in animals. Chemotherapy is a drug treatment that uses powerful chemicals to kill fast-growing cells in your body like cancer cells. Toxicology is that branch of science concerned with the nature, effects and detection of poisons or the measurement and analysis of potential toxins, intoxicating or banned substances and prescription medications present in a person's body. Hematology is that branch of medicine involving study and treatment of blood. Parasitology is the branch of medical science that deals with the study of endoparasites and ectoparasites. Endoparasites are those parasites that live within the body of host and ectoparasites are those parasites that live on the body of the host. Parasite is an organism that lives on or in the host and gets its food from the host. They get three benefits from the host they live in or on a host for shelter, food and reproduction. Milk is the lactear secretion of the mammary glands of animals. It is obtained generally from the cow or the buffalo during the period following at least 72 hours after calving or until the milk is colostrum free. Milk is a white opaque fluid in which fat is present as an emulsion 
protein and some mineral metals in colloidal suspension and lactose together with some minerals and soluble proteins in a true solution. In order to check the quality of milk, we perform several tests on it. Veterinary myrology is that branch of medical science that deals specifically with veterinary related viruses. Virus is an obligate intracellular parasite that typically consists of nucleic acid molecule in a protein coat. Is too small to be seen with the light microscope and can multiply only within the living cells of the host. Biotechnology deals with the application of biology and biological concepts to science and engineering for the welfare of mankind. Immunization is the process whereby a person is made immune or resistant to an infectious disease typically by the administration of a vaccine. Vaccines stimulate the body's own immune system to protect the person against subsequent infection or disease. Livestock management is defined as a program that focuses on the application of biological and chemical principles to the production and management of livestock animals and the production and handling of meat and other products. Theriogenology is the combination of two Greek words. Therio means animal and gen means coming into the world. It is that branch of veterinary medicine concerned with reproduction including the physiology and pathology of male and female reproductive systems of animals and the clinical practice of veterinary obstetrics, gynecology and andrology. Veterinary preventive medicine was established for the purpose of preventing and controlling globally important diseases of food animals and humans. To achieve its goal, veterinary preventive medicine combines the disciplines of veterinary microbiology, epidemiology, immunology, parasitology, public health, production medicine and clinical medicine. Dairy breeds are high milk producing animals. Farmers wish to keep high yielding animals because they provide us high milk yield. Pharmaceutical calculations are very important because they ensure the right amount of drugs that we administer to animals. The word anatomy is derived from the Greek word ana means apart and tomy means cut. It is the branch of biological science which deals with the structure and form of organisms. It includes the study of shape, weight, color, texture and relative position of various parts and organs of the organisms when in a state of normal health. Thank you very much for paying your attention and giving your precious time.